guys, it's Nicole, and I'm actually sitting in Regan's playroom filming this video because she's sleeping, and I don't want to wake her up in my scrap room that's right next door. Um, you can just see it is a mess right now. She's got, like, toys everywhere. <laughs> so, and I had her um, laying right here on this blanket playing, oh, sorry, the scrap stuff, but it is a mess. But anyways, um, I just wanted to share with you a small haul from um, MFT Stamps. And then I went to Michael's this week and used that 20% off everything, including sale items. So I just wanted to share with you what I got. And I'm using my 10-minute camera, um, so I might need to make this a two-part video. I apologize. Okay, from MFT, um, I had wanted this for a while. This is their By the Letters uh, die set, and it has been out forever, and I couldn't even find it on Simon Says Stamp, so... I marked the little notify me thing and they emailed me and let me knew, know that it was um, back so I put in a little order just so I wouldn't be paying for shipping for this just this thing but it's really cute I wanted to um, use it for a canvas mini album that I'll be making soon I'm just waiting on a studio calico order that I pre-ordered a long time ago um, then I got from their new release this chevron um, border die and just so you guys know, um, since I've been reading all of your comments and seeing what things you would like to see on videos, I'm really considering doing um, a card series that's just kind of a use it card series that makes me use all of my dies and things that I bought for cards. Because a lot of time I make cards and I don't make a video because I give them away right away. So um, I'm definitely going to make an effort to do that and, and I have an idea for this that I want to make a card with. And this is called Chevron Stripes. Then I got these speech bubbles. They were super cheap and I um, needed them for this canvas mini album that I'm going to be doing. Um, I have a photo over again and I wanted her saying something so I got this and it's called Say What and it was pretty cheap. I think it was only like five bucks. And then I got this pocket die because I'm going to cut it out in some fabric and sew it on and make a little pocket and put a note inside. So and this would also be cute to make a few cards with. Um, there's a stamp set that goes with it, but I didn't really like it, and it's called Pretty Pocket. So, and then I got, um, the free gift was the stamp set. Sorry, I don't really have anything to put behind it, but, um, I don't know the name of it. It's called About Anniversaries, and it has a bunch of little cute sayings there. So that was the free gift. Okay, then I'm gonna go over what I got at Michael's, and... Yeah, these are in no particular order. This is something boring, but just so you're aware, um, right now, and hopefully I post this video before the sale's over, but I don't know because um, I'm going to be going out of town for a few days, so I'm not really sure. But um, these, all their adhesives are buy one, get one 50 off, plus I have the 20 off everything coupon, so I went ahead and stocked up on dye, or I mean um, adhesive. And then, this is something I've been eyeballing for a while, um, it's the Instant Setter, and I have the manual one that you punch, um, Prairie Paper and Ink uses it a lot to put her ribbon, it makes like a little slot to put ribbons in, um, but this is the Instant Setter so that you don't have to sit there and manually hammer, and it was originally $24.99, and I just, even with the 40 off coupon, I couldn't see spending that. Well, today it was $9.99, um, they've been trying to get rid of it, so it was clearance to $9.99 plus I used a 20 off coupon so I got it for like eight eight or seven dollars which I thought was worth it so I'll let you guys know um, what I think about it then I got this punch this star punch because when I did that last layout of Regan being a superstar I swore I had a star punch and I wanted to do some um, using some of the negatives uh, after you punch this in paper I wanted to use the negative piece to add its layering and I didn't have Star Punch, so um, I went ahead and got this. I think it was $7 plus 20 off. And it's about, the star on it is about an inch, a little over an inch big. Then um, I got this neon yellow paint for $0.54 cents on clearance. And the reason I got it is because Reagan has an outfit that's gray and neon that she wears all the time. And we got some photos done of her wearing that outfit, so I wanted to scrapbook them. And I really wanted to use this neon. I saw... Um, Patty, who is um, colored sprinkles, and she um, does a lot of painting on her layout. So I think I'm going to give her technique a try and use some of this neon since it matches Reagan's outfit. And I don't know if you can really see that. The lighting's kind of funky in here. 
then um, I went ahead and got this Tim Holtz configurations tray. It was on clearance for $4.99 or $4.00. I can't remember. And I promised my friend Sherry, who is scrapping and wrapping, that if I ever found one on clearance, I would make a kit um, of kind of the one that I made for Reagan, but sell all the stuff that I used to make it with like a little one and make a mini kit. So I was like, okay, you know, I'm not really big on making kits, but I will give it a whirl. So I bought one of these so that I could create a kit and then you guys can use my kit to make um, kind of the same thing that I made Reagan, but a smaller version. All right, then I got two sets of thickers. Um, they have a lot of new thickers there, but I really just, I'm really needing, I know I have a ton of thickers and you guys know that, but what I have found is I'm super low on black, white, and red. Um, and I think that's because that's like nine times out of 10 what I gravitate towards. And they didn't, all their white thickers there had glitter on them and I'm not like a huge glitter fan, so I didn't get any of those. Um, and then they didn't really have any red. They had, like, raspberry, but I needed, like, a deep red. So I just got two sets of black. Um, this one's called Hardcover, and it's chipboard, um, glossy chipboard. And I got it in the black, and I like the font. It's nice, and they're nice and skinny. Um, sorry, I was just checking the time. And then I got, I've been eyeballing these for a while. Um, I have them in kind of, like, a raspberry, peachy salmon -y color. I'm not really sure what it's, and I didn't get it in the black and these are called fellow so I got these and I guess these could be used for white and black layout since they kind of have both on them then um never ever in my life did I think I would buy one of these but <laughs> um they have the new smash stuff there and I did not realize that they came out with a new one that was called baby style and what I thought this would be great for is, obviously I have um, a bunch of layouts that I do of Reagan, and I have a little album going. And then she has like a baby book that I put all her stats in, like, you know, her height, her weight, the first time she rolled over, etc. But I thought a smash book would be really good to highlight all of her firsts that have, um, I don't know how to, that I don't just take with photos, like when she gets her first haircut and I have a little clip of her hair, or she loses her first tooth, or whatever, um, I want to list all her favorite foods, things like that, I thought this would be really good for her, um, so I got a smash book, and I'm going to show you, no one's ever showed that I've seen the inside of the baby one, so I'm going to just show it to you guys for those of you that have, um, a baby, and then I might need to go to another video to show you the last of everything. But it's really super cute. I'm going to kind of just go quick here. I love that. It's got like craft paper. It says feed me and make it snappy. And then just hanging out in my crib. And it's got this little vintage picture of a girl in her crib. And it's got like A is for, B is for. Little alphabet soup. Um, I love you ski. I love that. And then today I'm a master of, and you mark it. Me Oh My, and it's got colors for girls and boys, so I like that. Cool must be genetic. Some letter paper. Sorry, I'm kind of rushing to see if I could squeeze this all in one video. Zip it, and a little passy. Um, Ten little itty bitty things you love. I love about you. Love this star paper, so cute. Love this. So cute. Rock on. Sorry, I know I'm not, like, getting it totally in um, the image. But it's just really cute, the game plan, and then you, like, write down. I love this page. It's so cute with the banners. I don't know if you can see that. And then this says Delish, and it's cereal all over the floor. This one says Half Pint. It's really cute. Um, let's roll. Yeah, so I got the baby one, and then I got some smash type stuff to go with it, um, which I'm going to just lay out really quick because I'm running out of time, but I got the date tape, these little pockets, these little stickies, and then I got the favorite person pad and the family pad. Okay guys, that's it. Thanks for watching.